Nine strange towns around the world. 1. Dongguan. Dongguan is a city in China that stands out for the reason that there are far more women here than men. In fact, women are also said to encourage such behavior. Often, men in the city date as many as three to four women at the same time. A lot of women come to Dongguan to work, which is why there are so many of them. According to a man, it is a lot easier here to find a girlfriend than a job. 2. Bangkala. Bangkala is an unusual town in Bali, Indonesia, where people speak a very unique language. Katakalik, literally meaning deaf talk in Indonesian, is a unique sign language that is the primary means of communication of the 44 inhabitants of Bangkala. For about six generations, an unusually large proportion of the town's population has been born deaf. The locals attribute it to an ancient curse, but scientists have attributed it to a recessive gene among the community which has been passed on from generation to generation. All kids, regardless of their hearing capabilities, have to learn the sign language in the village. 3. Sunny Shing Napa Imagine a town where homes have no front doors or locks, and shops are always left unguarded. The residents of this village in India believe that their houses are guarded by Lord Sunny, the god of Saturn. The neighbors trust each other and often leave their jewelry and money unsecured, firmly believing that their holy guardian will always protect them. 4. Wang Luo Wang Luo is a quaint village in China that is home to the Red Yao people, an indigenous community originating from the Qing dynasty. The picturesque village has a very fa famous trait, the pitch black hair of the women, who are famous for having long, Rapunzel-like locks. For these women, their hair is their most prized possession and they cut it only once in their entire life, that is when they turn 18. They are proud of their lustrous hair, which they wash in the river water, and also use a special concoction to rinse it. Long hair is considered to be a sacred symbol of beauty, longevity, and financial stability in Wang Luo. 5. Mono Y and Gross These are two tiny towns located in the U.S. state of Nebraska. Manawai is a town with just one resident, Elsie Isla. Isla is the mayor, plaque, treasurer, librarian, bartender, and the only resident in this tiny town. Gross is another town in Nebraska that has a population of just two residents, Mary and Mike Finnegan. 6. Santa Cruz del Ilote. This is a tiny Caribbean island home to about 1,200 people. It only spans about the length of two soccer fields but is one of the most densely populated places on earth. The residents of this island live in crammed houses but nurture a strong community spirit. The island is vibrant and happy, with children frolicking near the seashore or playing with small boats. The economy is based on fishing and other services, which the locals provide to the luxurious hotels on the neighboring islands. 7. Gate Horn this village in the Netherlands is sometimes called the Venice of the North. There are no roads in this serene and remote village. People only use boats to move around through the countless canals. These canals were once dug up by Peter Nerthing. The only way to travel by land is to ride a bicycle in the village. It is now a popular tourist destination due to its uniqueness and beauty. 8. Kamikatsu Kamikatsu is a small town in Japan that is on its way towards becoming a zero-waste municipality. For over two decades, the residents of this town have been reusing, recycling, and reducing their waste production. They have over 45 categories of waste segregation. The zero-waste campaign of the town has been largely effective and efficient. 9. Pip Lantry This is a small village in India where once the birth of a girl meant bad news, mainly due to the hefty jewelry system prevalent in the village. But thanks to the vision of Sham Sundar Paliwal, the former village head, the residents now celebrate the birth of a girl by planting 111 trees. It also sends a very strong social message to other villages that the birth of a girl child is a cause for joy and celebration.